five or maybe just rode the one with the field for the trifectas. But it's too late. The green light goes on. Favourite box seven, Windmill Hayes. Dine and H looks its danger. Away began well the favourite. Dine and H was slow away. Windmill Hayes is going to clear them and find the lead. Kenya Max getting up on the inside. Lit up goes to third. Dine and H tried to get through. Check badly. Trifectas are out the door. Jimmy McKinley behind those in Revel. To Steenie Laredo and Dine and H is last of all. Windmill Hayes is in front by three lengths. Kenya Max is holding down second. Trying hard behind those. McKinley and Revel is challenging on the outside. Then lit up at Windmill Hayes is home and host. Second, Kenya Max. Third goes to Revel. Uh, another placing here at Gawler. Fourth was uh, McKinley in front of Lit Up. Behind those, Dine and H never got into it after copying those checks into Steely Laredo at the tail end of the field. The time was around 31.09. Too good the favourite, Windmill Hayes. Box draw was ideal. 7.25 the judges' numbers. 31.09 was the time. Run home was 15.04. Seven two five and six seven two five six four and three quarter lengths the winning margin by three quarters four and three quarters by three quarters good jump by windmill Hayes and uh, never in doubt three twenty four then sixteen oh five with the early splits black dog May twenty fifteen Barsha Bala the contrary Mary Ken Gill the owner and the trainer and. Uh, no need to panic for favourite punters that took the shorts. A dollar fifty and a dollar twenty. Can you max two forty? No third dividend for number five Revel. Continues its good consistency here at Gawler. Six goes now for six placings. Three twenty four, sixteen oh five, thirty one zero nine the time. The run home was fifteen zero four. All clear.